Charles Taylor, an engineer from Golden, Colorado, is renowned for his innovative work on one-wheeled vehicles. Believing that conventional four-wheeled and two-wheeled vehicles were unsuited for mountain trails, Taylor embarked on a journey to create a one-wheeled vehicle that could tackle rough terrain more effectively. His efforts began around 1939 and culminated in the 1950s and 1960s with several working prototypes. Taylor's one-wheeled vehicle was driven by a chainsaw engine, and the gyroscope, crucial for stability, was powered by another chainsaw engine. The single wheel, approximately five feet high, was a small tractor tire. The vehicle utilized two gyroscopes, one mounted vertically for steering and lateral stability, and another mounted horizontally for longitudinal stability. Additionally, a weighted balance sensor and an air blower system assisted in pitch control. A torque reaction mechanism countered forces during acceleration and deceleration. Taylor's aim, as stated in his 1964 patent application, was to build an off-road vehicle superior to four-wheeled vehicles and motorcycles of his time. His creativity and ingenuity are remarkable as he developed these vehicles without computer assistance, relying solely on electromechanical systems for steering and balance. Taylor's work remained largely unacknowledged until after his death, when Oliver O'Reilly, an instructor at Berkeley, discovered his inventions. O'Reilly and his students studied Taylor's patents and home videos, attempting to understand the mechanisms. Despite efforts to reassemble the prototypes, the project has not yet come to fruition. Taylor's son, Charlie, still possesses components of his father's prototypes and hopes to see them reassembled. The legacy of Charles Taylor's one-wheeled vehicles lies in their innovative design and the potential they held for off-road transportation, making them a fascinating footnote in automotive history.